Welcome to May Sunday School, and I hope that this window looks familiar to you. I mean, I know it's been a really long time since we've seen it, but I thought it seemed appropriate to end our Sunday School year here in the chapel at First Lutheran Church. So I'm going to turn my camera around here so you can see me. So hey, welcome. Well, we are at the end of our church Sunday school year, and we have done, we have covered so much stuff, but through it all, I hope you remembered one thing, that no matter what, okay, actually two things, <laughs> no matter what, God loves you, and to be the light. So... I hope that you've been able to do some things to bring joy and God's love into other people's lives. And I have one more thing we're going to do to brighten some people's lives here at church. So what I am asking you to do is I'm going to attach a song to this video. We'll play a little bit later. Um, but what I want you to do is to learn the song. It's this little light of mine. And then I want you to join me at worship time for Time with the Children on May 23rd. It's a Sunday. And you can either be here at church in person and come see me, or you can also join us on YouTube or on the radio. But what I want us to do is I want us to sing that song all together because we haven't gotten to sing all Sunday school year. And I thought it would be a really great way to end our year by lifting up our voices and um, singing about being the light. So remember, practice and then join me on May 23rd for Sunday school, or for not Sunday school, but for worship, which is, by the way, at 9.30, <laughs> just in case you have forgotten. But until then, practice. And then today, I don't really have a story for us, but instead I have a devotional out of our Jesus Calling book. And if you did not get one of these at the beginning of the school year, please feel free to stop by church and we will get you one. But they're full of all kinds of good little, um, little tidbits and stories about Jesus. So this one, you probably have guessed, has something to do with being the light. And it goes like this. It's called Bubbling Joy. Only God's Spirit gives new life. The Spirit is like the wind that blows. Wherever it wants to go, you can hear the wind. But you don't know where it comes from or where it's going. And that's from John 3, chapter, or verse 8, sorry. It says, I am creating something new in you. Talking about you. A bubbling spirit of joy that splashes into others' lives. It isn't just an ordinary, temporary kind of joy, like a gift on your birthday. Those do bring a lot of joy, but that only lasts for so long. And it doesn't depend on what's happening around you. So this is something that doesn't depend on what is going on in your life. This is my joy. And when they say my, they're talking about Jesus. And it comes from the Holy Spirit living inside you, inside all of us, me and you and all of us. My joy bubbles up like the fizz of a soda until it spills over and blesses all of those around you. So don't try to control the ways my spirit moves through you. Just stay open as if you were a window on a summer day. My spirit is like the wind. You can't see the wind, but you know it's there because you can see the leaves and you can see the grass moving. In the same way, you can't see the Spirit, but you and all those around you can know that my Spirit is within you by the peace and the love and the joy that flow out of you. And it's true. That Spirit that's in all of us, that is, that, that is God's light. And don't try to control it. Let it fizz out. Let it bubble out and go everywhere because something we've learned about love is it is very contagious. 
And when you give out that love and that light, other people can't help but to do it too. So, so even on this last day of Sunday school, don't stop being the light. Continue on. Let that spirit just flow out of you and you will bring joy wherever you go. Well, are you ready for our song? All right, let's go try it. Hey everyone. All right, we are gonna practice this little light of mine and I'll put the words up on the screen and you can sing along. If you don't know the words and you don't know how it goes, we'll just listen and then sing along next time. But remember, remember on Sunday, May 23rd, for church worship, we're gonna sing it all together. So here's your practice time. Okay, and I have some helpers um, to help me sing it this time. So Amelia and Adeline and Lucas are gonna help and they're gonna sing along. So, all right, here we go. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. Let it shine, let it shine, let it shine. Join me for worship at First Lutheran Church on May 23rd at 9.30. And you can either come in person with your families or you can meet, meet with me on YouTube or on the radio. But we're going to all sing this little light of mine together. I think it'll be so cool to hear everyone again and to know we're all singing it together. And remember to continue to be the light, not just, not, not just today, but every day, okay? Let God's love flow out of you. And I'm hoping I will see you for Vacation Bible School this summer. Um, it is on June 29th, it's a Tuesday, and you can register on our website. So check out the First Lutheran website for more information and to register. So I hope I get to see you then. Before we go, how about we pray the Lord's Prayer together one last time, okay? All right, here we go. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not in temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thy is the kingdom, the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. All right, have a wonderful day, and thanks for coming, and be the light!